is Matrix Lord 212, and I'm freaking home, tired and stuff. I didn't even get to do my unboxing tonight, which I really want to do videos in an hour. I think Scott's coming home from work, and you know I'm gonna get the members together of the Rehuvians, trying to do some podcasts, some videos. Damn, freaking exhausted. So, what do I want to talk about? Well, first of all. Jonah Hill asking for more money than Robert Pattinson as Batman himself. That's ridiculous. Um, how about no, Jonah Hill? How about don't hire him? Because that's pretty messed up that he thinks he's better than Batman, for friggin' Christ's sake. So no, I don't think that's right. I don't think he should ask. I mean, go do 24 Jump Street or some crap like that. Um get Josh Gad, you know? And and that's the funny thing is that um Jonah Hill's role as one villain out of five, it's not like he's the main villain anyway. So what the hell he need all that money for? Um he sounds like an idiot asking for that too. So that's stupid. Um other than that, like there was that that story that I was watching throughout the day on and off about the uh, Bob Iger had released his autobiography or something, and he, they basically revealed that George Lucas freaking hated Disney's version of Star Wars. He thought it sucked, Force Awakens. They they lied to him. They they got him to sign the deal. They got they bought stuff from him, and then they didn't want to pay him for these characters. They created new characters so they wouldn't show his characters. I mean, it's disgusting, and. Just goes to show, like, you know, the Disney Star Wars isn't as good as George Lucas' Star Wars, that's for sure. I mean, look at all the stuff they're doing. Rather than have Boba Fett, we got friggin' The Mandalorian. Rather than have, like, R2-D2 and C-3PO, they got BB-8 and some other droid. I mean, it's like they're trying to get rid of all George Lucas' characters and replace them with newer versions or something like that, which is really dumb. Um, so... You know, I hated Last Jedi. Everybody knows that. I thought that was crap. And and I liked Force Awakens, but it was like a copy off of A New Hope. Because it was like the same shit. I agree. Um, but Kylo Ren is definitely a poor man's Darth Vader, that's for sure. Uh, although I do like Kylo Ren. Um, it, they made him so weak, though. Like, once he took the mask off, it was like, dude, put that freaking mask back on. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, I'm rambling because I'm tired. Um, yeah, there's other stuff to talk about tonight too, especially Doctor Who, so I'll make another video. Take care, bye for now.